Hello, hello, welcome once again on another video of figure analysis. Let's start it. We'll start with the same steps. So, yes, we'll start with the balance line, which will be drawn with the pit of the neck. And now I'm drawing a line that is called center front which starts from the pit of the neck and at the crotch level as shown mark the angles for shoulder level purse level waist and hip level i'm changing the color so that you could able to see it clearly Now I'm thinking to trace the body or, or uh, we can simply start with the head. I'm drawing this line from the center of the face. As you can see it's a side view face. So the center of the face would be in the extreme left. Covering the whole head in the box and marking all the levels for the features. Eyes, nose, lips and from chin to jawline connecting it and giving the correct shape of the head now tracing it to the body trying to trace and give the lines the, all the body parts would be touch as it's the very easiest pass we just need to trace the legs and the hands you just need to take a correct image while you're doing this so that you would be able to identify uh, her parts of the body so that you could know the right direction of the parts on another layer, I am taking the green color to mark the centers of the body parts. The hands. So I mark the circles for the joints like shoulder round, elbow and the wrist. Same for another one. So mark these lines from the center of the hand. Let's draw the armhole and marking another line which would be its side seam which is also a very important part. Do not neglect the side seam while you are making or tracing the figure. Connecting with the side seam I have taken the center of the leg and the other leg that is from the inside seam because it is a, uh, a side view figure. It's not always applicable on all, all the figures. So I just mark here one more line for the crotch level so that we could see all the lines are very much parallel to each other. Let's come to the sheet and I've already drawn these marks marked already at it is a 10 head block figure and I kept it like this marked all the important level before i have also mentioned what are all the levels you can take a screenshot of it or if you want to let me tell you how to make it then i'll also tell you that so let's quickly draw these angles waist level this is hip level and crotch level you could see all the levels are very much parallel starting and making this line which ends at the crotch area so marking it a point at the crotch area marking the center front of the body as you can see it's a little out at the bust level and merging it with the crotch level so trying to give the similar shape 
and now I'll draw the side seam as it will help me to give the direction at the back and hip as you can see it's bend at the backward so before we make the hands I'll make the armholes and the side seam which will help me to draw the leg also and after some distance like you could see there is the back and hip curve see it's the torso is done now nah? so half of your work is already done I think more than half is done because you could able to see how it is more looking like a figure that you want to achieve the torso is the key you should always be starting with the torsos and now we can see you could see this um, the knee level it's far at the right and the another one is at the left of the balance line always consider the lines through the balance line as it's a guideline so it is very important that you always consider the balance line as your guideline like from where to start the line is where from the balance line is it on the left is it on the right is it parallel is it away so on depends on your figure do not neglect the balance line it's very much important as I have marked in the another leg also the ankle now let's mark the center of the hand try to achieve the level let's just move it more because I could feel it should be more tilted anyways see we can always realize our mistake during the work it doesn't mean that we should be achieving it in the front as we have started it so it's okay it's fine giving some rough details with the hands so that we could give the details later starting the center of the hand from here I'm trying to achieve the right angle which is given in the figure neck is on the balance line and we will achieve that box first and then we will make the head inside so the angle is important make the box in the right angle see I have taken it the same it's shown in the figure and now we will move the hand at little upper level role is to make a circle in the box and a small circle here to make the chin and a line for as you can see the jaw line in the figure is very much close to the balance line so here also I am trying to achieve the same shape Yeah, now I'll give it Let's trim a little So you need to practice a little about how to achieve the perfect shapes because here yeah, Practice is the only key and yeah steps is the important that if you if you switch with the steps like first step is to draw the balance line and marking all the levels if you fail to do that though it means you have your starting is wrong and if the starting is wrong then it's hard to achieve the right figure or right posture of the uh, figure you want to achieve so it's better to analyze things step by step 
we'll give the details later let's just quickly mark the neckline also it's uh, the figure is more like a side view not completely side view but it looks more like a side view a little three-fourth view so this could be considered under a side view figure also let's just draw this one this leg I'm sorry, I'm using the too much eraser this time. Same thing we'll do with this leg. Let's just quickly clean this up and move to the final figure. touching it it's almost done yay let's erase the unnecessary lines and make it more clear more detailed tell me in the comment section how do you like my videos and uh, if you have any suggestions or any request like on which topics you want the videos please let me know in the comment section i would love to make the videos for you yeah it's neat and clean now thank you for watching hope you like this bye bye